Maybe we should grab another color? Let's do this! Let's get another color. Let's get let's, let's get let's get uh, blue. Uh, uh. Pink. Green. Orange. Make sure you've got a drop cloth on your table so you don't mess it up and grab something to paint on. You can use paper. I've got my black Sharpie. I like black, but you can really choose any color. And you're going to need a few paint brushes as well. And of course, I have my turquoise iris. Oh, one. yeah, baby. So let's get started on this, guys. Let's do this. I grabbed an 8x10 canvas. You can use any size that you want, but we've got our cup set out. You need to focus and quit lollygagging and all the shenanigan and shenanigans, shenanigans. Yes. Okay, so Sharpie. Iris. Check. Cups. Check. Different sizes. Check, check. Circles. Now, could we use squares? Sure. Could we use rectangles? We can use any shapes we want, but I think it might be fun to just use three different shapes, uh, three different sizes of circles. So the first thing I'm gonna do is start with the biggest one, which I think we'll do this size, and I'm gonna just randomly set it on my canvas. And all you have to do, guys, is just trace it. Yeah, in the paint world, we call this tracing. Yeah, in the paint world. There's no pattern that you guys get to have to follow. You can create your own pattern. I'm gonna put another one over here. And then I'm gonna start filling in with the other sizes. And you could even leave part of the circle off the edge if you wanted to go out like that, or like this, or like this. Where should we put it next, Iris? Over there. Over here? Over there. Over here. Over there. Here? There! Uh, here. Oh, yes, that's what I said. Oh, my stars, girl. Good? Yeah, that's good. Should I do one more, or are we good with this size? Well, that's whatever you want to do. Well, let's do this one, guys. I'm just making sure that you're not going to do this wrong. I thought we just agreed that there's no wrong or right way, Iris. Well, the right way is my way, and the wrong way is your way. Well, <laughs> you're ornery. Have you not had your breakfast? No, somebody hadn't made it for me. Matt. No, I said it was your turn, but it said since you're not going, then he's going to go give me donuts. Donuts? Yeah, donuts. Girl, it's your lucky day. Isn't this so fun? And so what we'll do is we'll pick colors 
and we'll do this in sections. If you want them to overlap, you can. That looks like a tennis ball. But we're creating, Hero, you're right. Like, I get it, I see what that you're saying. That one looks like a basketball over there. I see what you're saying. I love this. This is fun. We can create our own pattern. It's almost like a modern piece of artwork. And since school's out, we're so happy to be painting. You gotta have stuff to do. Okay, so now let's do the smaller one. I'm gonna do this um, because it's the smallest right here. We can just put it anywhere we want and create a whole bunch of different shapes. Be careful with your tracing. You're getting a little sloppy. Oopsies. That's oh. okay. You can't mess this up, Iris. That's true, that's true. You guys might want to get up and kind of walk around your table. I'm just kind of reaching around. This is a fun one. I'm going to use shades of blue. What other co what other colors, Iris? Black. Black, no. Oh, Green. Oh. What? Green. No. Like an elephant? You know elephants are gray? Yeah, I know elephants are gray, but I don't really want to use that color. Silver. Well, a metallic would be fun. Yeah, it's always fun. Yeah. Maybe gold. Let me get some gold and take it up in here. Okay. One more circle. Let's go back to the first big one we did, and let's do one more right here. And then we'll take a look, grab all of our colors, and start filling in all of the shapes. And then we've created our own piece of artwork. So simple. Anybody can do it. That even, looks like bubbles. Even I, little bubbles, you know? Ooh. Men that go outside with little bubbles. That's what it looks like. This is like a project even you could do, Iris. <laughs> what are you talking about? Who taught you how to do it? <laughs> All right. Iris, I'm going to start with mermaid tail. I love this color, okay? So I'm going to start filling in. Do you want a brush? No, I'm good. Okay. So what are you doing? I'm just going to fill in. But how are you going to fill in? How do you know what to fill in? I guess you just pick a place to start. I'm going to pick this corner and I kind of want to space out my colors so not all the blues are together. I'm going to pick like a blue here and a blue here and a blue here and like kind of kind of add a random pattern. What do you think? I'm a little confused right now. Are you? Yeah, because usually you're like you do this, then you do this, then you do this, then you do this. Now you're telling me you just do whatever you want. Well, that's kind of what art is, sweetheart. You get to just do what you want to create your own one-of-a-kind work. I don't think that everybody needs to put their blue in the same spot I'm putting, or that everybody's doing their circles in the same as me. I wish you get to create your own, which means you pick it, you create it, you pick the colors. Okay, I was just testing you, and you passed. You did pretty good, right? Didn't she do good? Ooh, she that passed. Was a tough yeah, question. I mean, this is like in the semester test, right? Now, this is her test, semester Honey, test. I've already been and she's to school. Done. She, she already passed that one, and then there's more to come. I've more to come. Been to school. She did really good, didn't she? Yeah, she's really good. Good answer. Do you good answer. Do you want me to use my teacher voice? Uh, no, thanks. We're, we're good. Do you want me to use my teacher voice? Sure. You better do this right way. Do you right now? Teachers don't talk like that. Well, the ones on my planet do. No, teachers are nice. I <laughs> teachers. Teachers are awesome. They say, especially team. Everybody. In the summer, like you, you team, I already told you that joke. Your right? seats, I already told you that. I told you the joke, right? Joke? Yeah, the joke. What joke? We the haven't had a joke. Three, the three words that teachers love to say the most? Or they love the most? Uh, sit down, be quiet. And June, the... July, August! Ah! Oh. <laughs> I told that last week. You probably were listening. You probably were listening. Of course so, I was listening. I just my seven that. fans out there, I think I've got eight now. I've got, I've got eight. Yeah, I've got eight. But anyway, they're like, text me, DM me. I said, oh my God, that was the funniest joke ever. I was like... Yeah, I know, but Dion didn't get it, you know, but that's okay. I did get it. I did. I just forgot about it, sweet cheeks. What are we having for breakfast, by the way? Yeah, Matt's going to give me donuts, so I'm not sure what you're having. Oh, that's right. Maybe a big, fancy, juicy cinnamon roll for me, too. Ooh. Okay, I like how this is coming together. Yeah, some good colors. Yeah, it looks a lot like me. So you got it. Did you get um, any A's or B's on your report card? Yeah, I got street C's. 
Straight C? Straight C, that's like the best you can get. You know, I'm pretty like, sure it's the best you can get, right? I feel like. I mean, on, on my planet, like straight C's are like the best ever. So they take grades on your planet too, huh? Well, yeah. Do they? Sure. Well, I, I heard not all planets do grades. Well, that's weird. How do you know if you're doing good or not? You just know, because your hmm. teacher tells you you did good. Hmm. They say, wow, you know what you're doing. They yeah, I guess, I guess so. That's pretty cool. It's pretty yeah, cool. They're not tested. That's what I hear, at least. This color looks fabulous. So, how's your, how's your day? Are you bored? Well, you know, I'll let you take do all the painting, take the spotlight away from me. Yeah. You know, because I don't want to steal the show. Because you're you know? the talent. Yeah, pretty much. So far, we're looking good, guys. How's, how's it going with you guys? you guys and I'm gonna do a really good close-up in just a second. Iris you'll have to hold it for me maybe huh? That's to my paint. Oh well. I just had my nails done. We can let it dry. Matt took me on our weekend massage. Oh well I didn't get that massage. Yeah every Friday we get massages. So there we go you guys. What do you think? That's really good. So what kind of technique is this? It's called the circle cup technique. The circle cup technique? I've never heard of that. Actually, I kind of like it. Did you just make that up? I kind of think it looks like a mosaic glass. Oh, like yeah, a stained, I can see that. Yeah, like yeah. a stained glass or I, a type I of I think mosaic. it looks like a bunch of tennis balls that went through the wrong paint factory. Well, you always turn everything we do into a 
baseball, basketball. Well, I mean, it's round. Yeah. Looks yeah. like a ball. I think it turned out pretty good, though, and it's fairly easy, you guys. But you don't need hardly anything to do this. Nope. Like a little bit of paint. You need like a little bit of paint. Yeah. And then you need a little brush, maybe, and then maybe some cups. Maybe like, you can find like triangle stuff, and you can use shapes. Just find all different kinds of shit. Stop it, I'm trying! Okay, now so you can use all this stuff. It's really cool. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. That was just gonna. We're gonna talk just about funny. that later. It's just funny. It's kind of funny. We're gonna talk. She was like, and I was like, what? Yeah, I just, what? He's my karate. You almost got me. Iris, you guys have an awesome weekend. Enjoy your Memorial Day weekend, and we will see you next week, eight Central Time. No. 8.30 a.m. Central Time.